And the deposed Emir of Kano, Mohammed Sanusi II, says he could have challenged his removal in court if he wanted the throne back as it was so badly done. As Sanusi was dethroned by the Kano state government, accusing him of insubordination. In a video circulating on so social media, Sanusi said the dethronement letter sent by Kano state government was poorly written and would have been easy for him uh, to proceed to the court to challenge it. Yes, I'm, I'm moving on. I, I didn't want to go back. You know? So frankly, um, the truth is, if I wanted to go back, the, the, the letter was so badly written. This was so unprofessionally done. It is the easiest thing in the world to go to court. Fair hearing, high court, just like today. It's simple, fair hearing. Did you query him? Did you tell him? Did you ask him to, to defend himself? Did you even call him to ask him any question? No. That's that's all. You know? But no, I think uh, we should go on with a new phase in life. Which is now for 201 years. Since Dabo started, not a single prince whose father was not Emir made it to the throne. I was the first. Every other prince after Dabu was the son of an Amir. I was the first grandson to defeat sons of Amir. So, I mean, I mean I, it's a blessing that I should thank God for, you know, and uh, so many things to be thankful for. Uh, the, the structures and the palace will be there for hundreds of years, and it's history. Uh, the, the law we, we codified for Muslim, on the Muslim family law Kaduna State is about to pass. If Kaduna State has been delayed, Kaduna State is about to pass, or probably the first state to pass the law, three years of working with scholars dealing with issues around age of marriage, domestic violence, uh, women's rights, you know, um, child rights, all these issues of street breaking and um, arresting fathers, they're all in the law. And, and, and those are the kinds of things that are essential for transforming society. So for me, I'm proud of just the years that I put in, just like I was proud of the years I put in the central bank. And uh, I'm sure that there will be many more things I'll be proud of doing um, going forward so long as, as we have life and health, which is what we pray for. And so... And I would say that the airport, you can you can always have what this was an ex president, this was an ex governor, this was an ex emir, an ex commissioner. You can't say this was an ex intellectual, this was an ex intelligent, this was ex educated person. So there, there are certain things that I hold uh, and I cherish, and, and, and those are things that can never be taken away from you. And uh, what these other things? It's just a face. Just a face. I wanted to be Amir, and Alhamdulillah, I was. And it's there in the record, you know, and the history is there. And what happens today is not important. When you're dealing with an institution like the Amir, it is when the history of Kano is being written over the next 50 years, 100 years, that is when, that is what will really matter. How are you going to be remembered uh, long after you've gone? Not what. You could be on the wrong side of the present, but if the present is dysfunctional, <coughs> then you're on the right side of history. These are all important considerations. It's on the streets and they're happy, you know, because of the injustice they suffered. And, you know, it's, so it's, it's nice to see that people are crying, people are grieving, and uh, it says at least that in the years that who were there, we give them good leadership and we can only pray that whoever comes after continues to give good leadership and they will need to enjoy good leadership.